Hey, welcome to Neighborhood Watch. I'm Derek. I'm Jess. That's Jess. <laughs> and uh, Neighborhood Watch is a little uh, segment we do on uh, Noise in the Neighborhood. Um, this is the third installment, installation of the installment of Neighborhood <laughs> Watch, um, where we uh, talked about some shows that are coming up in the next month or so. So yeah, we've got some shows. Um, I guess Picked I'm... out just for you. For you. For you. <laughs> All right. Well, um, I guess I'll kick it off. Um, I've got one on August 30th. It's at Lucy Lane. Um, search for the event so you can uh, check out the description of Lucy Lane and all the things you need to know about that. Uh, DIY or die. Cool venue. Um, but this show is going to have a feature uh, Minor Moon from Illinois, uh, Sid Kingsley, and Rebecca Rafferty, also writer on the bill. Let's check that out. August 30th at Lucy Lane. Should be a good time. Also on the 30th, Super Doppler is having an album release party at Hardywood with the Wimps. Album release. Yeah. Very important thing. Celebrate the new music. Another show on the 30th, so many things. Richmond's bountiful with fun times to be had. Shag Wolf, Good Dog Nigel, and Railgun, and the Mitras, former Noise in the Neighborhood guest. Love to see it. <clears throat> at the Camel, should be a good time. At the Camel. The Camel. All right, I've got one for you, uh, very close to the neighborhood of Noise in the Neighborhood. Um, it's in uh, the Capitol House in Midlothian. August 31st, a uh, little duo action featuring Jordan Letty and Tara Dillard, um, also of The Folly, so go check that one out. Another show on the 31st, Jackass Flats at Isley Brewery, so you can have some brews, have some bluegrass, should be a good time. Oh, and a Sunday fun day event for Labor Day at River City Roll. There's going to be Pom Pom and the Trigody Band. I like to think of a great bowler because I get all the strikes. <laughs> Labor Day strikes. All right, uh, my turn, right? Nope, on the 4th okay, at turn. the Hoff, there's going to be Jawala Collective. They have this cool little uh, space on the second floor. They've started doing a lot of shows there called The Dark Room. Uh, yeah, it should be good. I've got one at the dark room as well. Uh, First Friday's reggae. Um, that's September 6th. It'll feature Lost Soul Society and Shamans of Sound. So the next day at the National, Flying Lotus is in town. I'm super excited. I know it's not exactly a local band, but should be really fun. All right. Well, um, I've got one featuring some local singer-songwriters. Uh, on September 8th at Metro Bar and Grill, um, there's the Garden Party. Um, it'll uh, feature Jonathan Facca, friend of the show, Eliza Francis, Bambi, Lisa Marie, um, Brendan Murphy, and Caroline Danielle. So on the 9th, they do a really cool industry night at Poor Boys Museum District, uh, another project from the illustrious Annalise. I think it should be a really fun time. On the 10th, uh, Glove the Gilberts, Good Dog Nigel at Fallout. It's a Fallout, if you've never been, is an interesting place. It's like a kink and fetish bar. So sometimes you'll see, you know, a little nudie Rudy strapped to the wall. But you can smoke inside, so I think it's fine. I think you should go. It should be fun. Well, very good. Well, um, so yeah, I've got a group of shows on August 14th. You know, you paid rent two weeks ago. You don't have to pay for another two weeks. 14th, live it up. So uh, an early one at Hardywood Park. On September 14th, uh, Tyler Meacham, who also has a uh, Kickstarter out to finish up uh, a, a, a finish up uh, EP she's been working on. Um, that bill will also feature Ruckus the Bulldog and Sincerely Iris. That's at Hardywood Park. Now, if you want a good hip-hop show on the 14th, um, you can check out um, Young Flexico, Michael Millions, and the reason I failed Latin in high school, Nicholas F. Um, they will be at Wonderland. I'm a huge Nicholas F fan. He uh, just came out with some music with Obliv. Uh, you can catch that on YouTube. Uh, they're great. Two, uh, you know, Richmond legends just I, doing the damn thing. I walk by his mural all the time. Hell yeah. Um, and then I've got one more on the 14th. Audacity Brass Band with Aerodynamics at Cary Street Cafe. So another show on the 14th. La Chambre, Piranorama, and Night Idea all at Gallery 5. So there's... No shortage of things to do here in Richmond, but that weekend, that same weekend, Pasture Palooza up in Berryville, always featuring a bunch of great uh, Richmond bands as well as some other regional acts, should be a good time. We've had some good, uh, good time at Pasture Palooza. We had a Palooza. We had a Palooza of the time. 
All right, a little punk show for you on September 15th at Mojo's. They've been putting on some uh, really good punk shows, making some noise in that neighborhood. Um, this one will feature Holiday from um, Oklahoma City and then Richmond Band's Railgun and Ghoul Trouble. I went and saw a show there last night, and that's why I'm a little tired today. A little tight tie. A little tight tie. Um, so on the 21st, there's Stone's Throwdown. Uh, you know, Stone's Throw, the brewery, they put on an event down at Browns Island Get a bunch of great bands, normally like 10 bucks, a bunch of good beer. Should be a good time. I think White Denim's going to be there this year. I'm very excited. White Denim after Labor Day? So passe. <laughs> All right. Uh, this one's not in Richmond, but it's a bunch of Richmond bands uh, outside of Richmond. Um, down 95 um, or 64 in uh, <laughs> Norfolk. <laughs> Don't get lost. Take 64. Uh -huh. um, minor poet Sammy Lanzetta and Stray Fossil will be at Charlie's. That's Charlie's American Cafe, and uh, they're doing a little tour together, Minor Poet and Sammy Lanzetta. That's it, Charlie's American Cafe in Norfolk. Three great Richmond bands taking over Norfolk. I love to down, see it. Down 64. So um, that, that weekend, Watermelon Park up in Berryville, uh, just a great bluegrass festival. Uh, just They've been doing that event for years now, and you really can't find a better lineup of artists and it should be just a great time. And I've got a, a small little festival I found today. Um, it's called Scoochie Fest. I think I'm saying that right, hopefully. Um, Scoochie Fest on the James River. That's September 21st um, for a good cause, uh, Mike Pascucci Cancer Association. Um, and the bands uh, featured on that is going to be strain, uh, something strange, I'm sorry, something strange, Blue Rooster Band and Agents of Good Roots. And the last show we have picked out for you Ways Blood at the Broadberry on the 24th. That's a Tuesday. Uh, she just put out a great album earlier this year, Titanic Rising. I can't get enough of it. I've been listening to it on repeat. It's great. You should go. Should be fun. Fantastic. Well, this has been the third installment of Neighborhood Watch brought to you by Noise in the Neighborhood. Um, and, of course, we can't cover every show that's going on in Richmond, so we'd love to hear about them. Feel free to post any shows um, you want to put out there in the comments and things like that so everyone can see those as well. But, yeah. Go to the gig. Go, Go have gig. fun. Enjoy all that the lovely city has Keep to offer Keep it real. You. Keep it real. Peace.